Hi, I'm Suzanne Boder, and I've been a business owner and a strong supporter of Nevada County for many years, and so is my mom. My mom has lived here for a number of years as well. Well, about five years ago, she was diagnosed with dementia. Since then, she's been in a care facility. It's been a rough go. It's been a rough go for all of us. My mom has been uncomfortable and anxious and not understanding what's going on. And about two years ago, last November, we really thought we were going to lose her. She was going through a number of issues and problems and just, it was time to call in hospice, we thought. We thought she was going to um, go, go from us. We thought we were going to lose her. Well, Hospice of the Foothills came in. They assessed the situation, her medication, her anxiety level, what's happening with her, and we really wanted them to just make her comfortable, get us all through this process in the best possible way. Well, through this process, they regulated her medication, they looked at her anxiety level and what needed to be done, and she graduated. She graduated a few months later in the spring, and we didn't even know that was something that actually happened. Well, it did, and since then, she has um, gotten better, you know, she's happier, she's more regulated in her medication and in her anxiety levels and what she's doing in her life and we all feel better, she feels better. And I think the bottom line is if this happens again or maybe I should say when that happened, I wish I would have known to bring in hospice sooner. Hospice is not the end of life. I found that, especially with the people we worked with, Hospice of the Foothills, that they were there to help just assess the situation and assess what her needs are to keep her comfortable in her daily life. And I would suggest that we do that sooner next time than later, because it's made a big difference in our family. And you know, she's doing well, she could live forever now. I don't know, we don't know, but at least she's comfortable. And I'm glad I brought in Hospice of the Foothills.